Hello, this is Vijaya from Grey Edge Team. In this video, we will be exploring the enhanced key features of 3ds Max 2022. Let's begin with Smart Extrude. With 2022, Smart Extrude is now available within the Edit Poly modifiers and offers the same time saving and flexible features from within its editable poly application. So let's see it. As you can see, Edit Poly is applied already on the selected object. I'll switch to polygon mode. Select the required polygon for Smart Extrude. Press Shift key and drag it with the help of Move tool. So you can see the Smart Extrude now. In addition to this, now Smart Extrude supports Cut Through mode. For Cut Through mode, you have to go with Smart Extrude and drag it to the another side of the polygon. It will delete the selected polygon on the other side creating an hollow effect with an easy way. Let's see the next enhanced feature in Slice Modifier. We'll select the object and apply Slice Modifier to it. You can see some additional options in it. The first option is Slice Type. There are two options in it, Planner and Radial. According to selected Slice Type, the options is going to be listed. Let's set planner as a slice type for now. Before going with any of the option, I'll set the slice type to remove positive. You can go with remove negative as well. We can select slice along axis. I'll go with slice plane and adjust it. With 2022, you can go with multiple axis. If flip is enabled, it will slice the object to the opposite side of the corresponding axis. If you want to slice an object on the basis of a reference, go with pick object. We will go with pick object and select the reference object. You can see the object getting sliced. Now if you want to change the slice plane, instead of changing the slice plane, you can select the reference object and you can see the slice plane getting shifted with it. Let's set radial as a slice type now. Same as planner you can go with slice along. In radial slice you will get two options angle 1 and angle 2. Angle 1 is to set the minimum slice value and angle 2 is for the maximum slice value. Let's see the next enhanced feature that is in symmetry. We'll apply symmetry to the selected object. Same as slice type, in symmetry also you will have symmetry type, planner and radial. Let's go with planner for now. You can select mirror axis and along with this you can adjust the mirror. You can go with multiple mirror axis. You can flip and it will flip on the corresponding sides. Let's switch to radial now. So select the axis, you can define the numbers of counts here. You have to keep on changing the mirror plane. Here you get an additional option called mirror symmetry. If mirror symmetry is enabled it mirrors half of the geometry to generate a clean scene. See? If enable flip, it flips the mirror half of the geometry to the opposite side. Okay. 
So with all this enhancement, we can speed up the 3ds Max workflow. Thank you for watching the video.